up in West, some, somewhere in Westchester. I'm going to look it up. Yeah. Well, that's the scripture, man. Uh, Proverbs 12 and 26. It, it says the, the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, which us, even though you have a Jake going off, committing all kind of wickedness, he's still righteous because the mere fact that he's an Israelite. And he's still better than you so-called white people because you were created to be the devil. You were created to be the wicked. And reading on, it says, but the way of the wicked seduceth them. So we're giving you plenty of example. That drug thing, that came from you. That's your thing, you so-called white people. And you begin with your international bankers. That's their thing. As a matter of fact, that's one of the things that made them uh, a, a lot of money, those drugs. Because when you go back into history, like uh, take, for instance, the Rothschilds, one of the main uh, drug that made them very rich was the opium, opium yeah. the opium trade. All right, so... That's just an example right there. You, you had something you wanted yeah, to say? Yeah, can I got a quick precept? This is Isaiah 51 and 19. I'm uh, sorry, I started at 20. Thy sons have fainted. They lie at the head of all the streets as a wild bull in a net. They are full of the fury of the Lord, the rebuke of thy power. You know, just like Elder Rakai was just speaking about, you know, them, them uh, uh, trains filled with guns. And they got there, and that's how Jake is. They, they, they're like destitute uh, 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 languishing uh, um, on these corners, hanging out. That's all you do. You got a guy that's fifty years old, sixty years old, and he's still hanging out on the corner. Yeah, yeah. Uh, number three. Uh, this is a continuous war. It says a national. We're back in the article. Um, the parallels between um, the Roman Empire and uh, America. Continuous war, a national state of security arises, distracting attention from domestic challenges with foreign wars. Similar to the late Roman Republic, the U.S. for the past 100 years has either been fighting a war, recovering from a war, or preparing for a new war. World War I, 1917 to 1918. World War II, 1941 to 1945. The Cold War, 1947 to 1991. The Korean War, 1950 to 1953. Vietnam, 1953 to 1975. And who started all these wars? You so-called white people, beginning with your elite banking well, families. Well, no, his son. Um, actually, it was the bankers, brother. Yeah, the, the You know, because yeah, the, the average Joe Cracker, and, and that includes Tucker Carlson, because Tucker don't know what's going on. Yeah. He leads on like he knows what's going on. These these jur these so-called journalists and these media people, they don't know what the hell's going on, man. Nope. Cause somebody put a comment on 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 the video about uh uh this guy Sean Hanny that Sean Hanny should come down. Sean Hanny ain't gonna come down, man. Cause he'll 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 get turned he'll get he'll get turned inside out. Cause he claims he's such a Christian. But if you do come down, bring uh what's her name, the bitch. Oh, that, Megan Kelly? Ma bring Megan Kelly with you, yeah. all right? Oh, we'll come up there. We'll come right to you. We'll set up a camp right in front of your studio, man. Okay? But anyway, let, me, let, me, let me just read this real quick. All right, this is from the New York Times, and this happened uh, yesterday, right? Son of, son of David Rockefeller dies in a small plane crash. All right, Dr. Richard Rockefeller, son of the billionaire and prominent philanthropist. Well, he ain't never sent no money my way, so fuck him. David Rockefeller was killed Friday morning when the small when when the small plane he was piloting crashed shortly after take takeoff, according to spokesman for the family. Dr. Rockefeller, 65 years old, was the only person on board the plane, which the authorities identified as a Piper Meridian single-engine uh, turbo uh, prop. The cause of crash was not immediately uh, clear. Dr. Dr. Rockefeller took off from Westchester County Airport um, at 8 a.m. Uh, oh, departing from run runway. Yeah, that's up there near Armonk. Yeah, yeah. uh, runway, because the company I used to work for, we used to do deliveries over there. So I've been there a number of times, all right? Mm, check that out. Check that out. From runway 16 into Dent Fog and, and steady rain, Less than 10 minutes later, the Federal Avi Aviation Administration uh, notified airport off officials that it, could not, that it could not reach the pilot. So, I mean, it goes on. 
but but that's a Rockefeller, a prominent guy who's who who's an insider, okay? Who knows about the Illuminati, who's a part of the Illuminati, all right? Who was part of the conspiracy not to teach because he knows who the Israelites are. They, the, the super elite know who the Israelites are. So now they're, be, they're, now they're beginning to, to uh, you know, confront us now. All right? Yeah, and the Rockefeller, which is actually a Rothschild, which the, the American, the, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, right. the Rockefellers are, are an American counterpart of but the Rothschild. But the thing is, even if they wasn't, they, in, they marry, they intermarry among each other yep. any damn way. Yeah, because we you take it. two super rich families yeah. and they'll have their sons and daughters marry each other, so that becomes two families coming into a, a dynasty, man. Yeah, yeah, because we found an article. I, I don't remember the name of it. Where the article they brought out the fact that the Rothschilds are nothing but the American counterpart of the Rothschilds, uh, the Rockefellers. I'm sorry, the Rockefellers are an American counterpart of the Rothschilds. So it's all coming out on you devils. But going back to these wars now. The scripture I was thinking I had in mind was there was given him a great sword, which is in the book of Revelation. And that's an example of the great sword. That's what you do. You create wars. Your, your elite banking families. That's what they do. Wasn't it my Amshel Bauer who said you always want to buy when blood is running in the streets? So what mind frame did he have when he made that statement? He had the mind frame of war. He had a mentality of war. I got a quick precept. Yep. This is uh, Habakkuk 2 and 12. Woe to him that buildeth a town with blood and establish a city by iniquity. And there's a, examples. World War One, World War II. Because right after World War II, America prospered. But it took World War II for America to prosper. Right after 1945, uh, from 1945 to what, 19, the early 60s, America enjoyed a, a great uh, amount of prosperity. All right, and then when the '60s came in with Vietnam, then America started uh, uh, tanking again. All right, um, Vietnam, 1953 to 1975, Gulf War, 1990 to 1991, Afghanistan, 2001, and ongoing. So this is an ongoing war. All right. Also, they they bring out in the movie 1984, they bring out about continual warfare. They mention about that. They they mention it does. Neither side has to win. You just have to have the illusion right. of war. Yeah. war is you know, peace, they say. war is peace and freedom is slavery. Yep. That was a quote from uh, 1984. Yep. All right. Back in Isaiah 47, because uh, uh, what you brought out after uh, the six, like around going into the mid to late 60s, is when America started going down. Yep. Take the millstones and grind mill. Uncover the locks, make bare the leg, uncover the thigh, pass over the rivers. Thy nakedness shall be uncovered. And that's what's happening. Uh, basically, really, uh, around the time of the 60s, the late 60s, that's when America started being revealed. Because, uh, like Elder Gabar read that thing, after World War II, America had that prosperity. And that's true. 1945, which uh, that's when World War II ended. But they they started the World War II to bring the country out of the depression during the 30s because America was in a Great Depression, which the bankers uh, generated that so that they could so that the government could get involved in uh, 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 um, everything, man, so that the government could take control. So pretty much, yeah, tighten its grip on the people. So pretty much that was martial law back then. That's how they came with all the, the the New Deal. FDR's New Deal. That's when they came with all the government. What? That was the that was the formation of government programs, government subsidized programs, man. Social Security. Social Security that's when they started uh, doing away with the with the gold standard, man. Okay, the the the, the paper, the, the the FRN, the Federal Reserve note. That's when they implemented all that. But the country prospered. That's when they had all all these cars being made, television sets. And the 50s came along, and then when the TV came out, nobody, maybe a few people had TVs, but all of a sudden everybody started having television sets. Then they had the color television set. Computers. Then the shit, man, well, the computers started coming in. You understand? It was a great prosperity. People were working. In the 50s, man, that's when all them shows, uh, Leave It to Beaver and all that shit come out. That's when the white people were living good where... 
The parents stayed together. You know, there was no such thing. It was rare that you heard of a divorce. Yeah. They would change that whole thing, man, was uh, uh, the Vietnam War. Yeah. The Vietnam War was also a banker, banker's war, but what it did was it opened trade for the drugs to come up here in the community, man. Yeah. It was unheard of to have a, a person doing cocaine or heroin yeah. in America prior to uh, 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 the <laughs> Vietnam conflict. Cut. Man. Cut. You know, let me read this real quick. It's, this is a lecture 26, fall of the Roman uh, Republic, uh, 133 to 127 BC. It says, uh, 